This has been going pretty well and I'm excited I haven't killed it yet. But in this video I wanted to share how to install effects, titles, generators to your Final Cut Pro library and to make it super simple to download it each time without having to go through the long process of finding the folders and making sure it's the correct one and dealing with all of that. Hey friends, welcome back to the channel. Now that we're in Final Cut Pro and we have Finder open, let's say we want to install this transition. These same steps would work for effects, titles, and generators, the path we're going to use. Now when we have Finder selected, go up here to go, click on computer, click on applications, go to Final Cut, but don't double click it or it's going to open it up, which we don't want to do that right now. Then we do show package contents, click on contents, plugins, media providers, motion effects, contents, and resources. And finally templates. And now we have our generators folder, effects folder, titles, or transitions folder. Whichever folder the effect or title should go in. Since we had a transition, we'd be clicking transition folder and you'll paste the object wipe transition here. I've already done so, so you just copy paste. I like to copy paste just to make sure everything works and then delete it from my download so I don't have double copies. Now to make this process even faster, you can actually just drag the template folder into the side window, which is gonna create a copy for it. I'm not gonna do so again because I've already done so down here. So when I click on this, I'm already in the path to install my files, so then I don't have to do it another time or take the long way, which is just a small, simple shortcut to install effects in Final Cut. Now once you've done so, just to make sure everything works properly, we can see if our transition installed. Just click on this, just click on this to show the transitions, or you can use a shortcut, which is Control Command 5, which opens up the transitions. And you can see the object wipe transitions are loaded up and ready to go. See you in the next one where I'll be talking about how to install sound effects to your Final Cut Pro library.